Hey guys, welcome back with another video. Uh, I actually recorded about 30 minutes worth of footage, but I deleted it because it was useless. As you can see, I have one death, nothing contributed, I only captured a base. I couldn't find anybody, even though there's a lot of people, a lot of my team are taking the kills. Um, what happened was, I ran out of fuel. I got into a dogfight with an F5 that I couldn't kill. Uh, he didn't kill me, I ran out of fuel, I had to... He got killed by a teammate, actually. And... I tried to make it back to base, but I couldn't uh, on a dead engine, so that's a, basically a summary of what happened. But with that said, let's go ahead and try and get out of here and perform uh, something good. Obviously, if this got uploaded, that means I performed well. The other one was basically a really boring video. Oh no, I forgot to switch out my 23Rs, so I'm stuck with the 23Rs right now. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to use them. Gears are up, we're good to go. Like I said in other videos, I'm trying to keep these videos short, so I'm limiting them to uh, 30 minutes each, roughly, roughly 30 minutes each, plus or minus a few minutes, um, just so that they're a little more bite-sized. And um, I'm, I'm gonna, if the battle takes longer than 30 minutes, I'm gonna break it into parts. If I'm still flying, you know, I'm gonna do part one, part two of the same battle. Um, I feel that that's gonna help me produce more videos uh, for you guys to enjoy uh, on a weekly basis. So that's what I'm gonna do. Just because of the fact that uh, in simulator battles, the, the battles take so long. I almost hit that mountain. Wow. Wasn't paying attention. Okay. Uh, we got destroyed. Okay, those, those bombers up there are ours. What? Where? Oh, it's there, I think. Why is he locking me up? Alright, potential... Yeah, no, definitely not potential. Potential my ass. That's definitely hostile. I'm too fast. I lost sight of the hostile, so I'm going to chase down the friendly. I see the friendly. Fuck. That was a big turn. Jesus. You kidding me? Completely lost sight. What am I doing today? Follow me. <sighs> Wasn't him. Okay. Let me mark myself. Let's see if. Nope. Okay, he's behind me. All right, good. Now I'm wondering, is that the friendly chasing the enemy, or is that the enemy? Because if that's the friendly chasing the enemy, that means the enemy is about to shoot my ass. Okay, that's the enemy. F4. Okay, this shouldn't be... I lost sight. Okay, I see him. I'm sorry guys, I keep having to look forward because we're literally fighting in the mountains. This is like a high risk um, location. It's remote, it's it's a risk. Alright. I'm gonna lead, pers or not lead, lag pursuit. Uh, I wanna get on his tail, so if I lead, I'm just gonna overshoot. I'm controlling my altitude with my rudder right now. Okay, we're getting into a really good state here. He's starting to realize that he's not going to win this. Uh, is that? That's an A-10. On me. On me. 
Okay. Good. Where's the four? Where's the F4? Where's the F4? You have got to be shitting me right now. I have to run. I don't know where the F4 is. Lost visual completely. I, I had to look at the A10 because I didn't know if the A10 was going to head on me with those 30 mils. That would have been a really quick death. I'm checking my rear view mirror. You have to fly intelligently, especially since there's very little data link, there's no communication with the teammates. So you have to fly very smartly. You can't just stick to somebody if you want to survive. You have to pull off and you have to know when to... Okay, I see someone. I think that might be him. I'm going to have to go around this mountain and seek him out. Okay, pick them up, pick them up. Come on, come on. Ah! I picked him up with the sensor. Okay, I think that's him. See, A10 just killed someone. Oh, wait, no, that was a... Uh... I have to be careful because there's a phantom somewhere around here. This... Missiles cannot take any longer to warm up. That's one kill. Six looks clean for now. I'm still pretty freaking worried about the F4. You have to be paranoid. You have to be. Paranoia keeps you alive. You feel paranoid for a reason. I'm picking up stuff here, but I can't see it. Come on, I saw. Okay. Attention to the map. IFF, IFF. Okay, that's. I I can't tell. There's too there's too many there's too many fucking things going on here. Okay, let's uh go inspect. It's way too many enemies. There's, this place is fucking, fucking jam-packed. Attention to the designated grid zone. Okay, that's a hostile, I think. Attention to the designated grid square. F5 in the front. No. Uh, come on. Okay, he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. All right, good. Wait, that was a, is that a Swede? No, that's oh, that's a Mirage. Okay, I'm I'm like, is that a Swedish? Is that's a Swedish? He just team killed. Checking our six. We have to stay fast in here, so I have to burn. I see one up there. Let's go check it out. Let's stay low as low as possible. Game ping 10 o'clock remember just because they ping you doesn't mean you're on the radar 6 o'clock ping okay there's a fight there I have to help I don't want to lose my teammates too many signatures here I'm very nervous Extremely uncomfortable. This is a disgusting feeling, to be honest with you. Alright, that's a hostile. I think that's a hostile. He just fired, let's see. Okay. Somebody just got hit. Uh, nope, nope. Nope, nope, that's the hostile. The hostile just got shot down, I think. Uh, I'm not sure, so I have to check. I have to verify. I think, yeah, I think I'm correct. Yeah, I am correct. Okay. Yeah, that's a mirage. I need to get back into the mountains. On me. On me. Let's, re 
report our location. <sighs> this is a pretty high stress um, situation that we're all in here. Actually, it's not. It's, it's really not pleasant. Is that the Mirage or is that IFF? Come on. Either IFF or report yourself, bro. Okay, yeah, that is friendly. Okay. Yeah. Somebody over there. Easy on the fuel. Alright, let's IFF this guy. Friendly. Okay. Lock from... Okay, okay, okay. Potential threat. Potential threat. No. Okay, friendly. I gotta report my location a lot because I'm scared that a friendly is gonna kill me. There's too many friendlies. There's too much going on in here. A lot of people don't use their radars to IFF, they just spot and shoot and hope that it's an enemy. Okay. I forgot to turn off my radar. Come on. Seven ping or spike seems stationary. Ten. Uh, shit, shit, shit. Potential anti air, potential anti air or not. What is this? I just picked something up on my IR. Oh man, if there's an anti air here, I'm so dead. Yep. Seven. Oh, oh shit, anti air. I just saw that. Roll back the video. You're gonna see that uh, if you look on the corner on the bottom left, you're gonna see uh, a Gepard or something shooting rounds at me. I feel like Gaijin should implement uh, the AWACS. The AWACS could easily be the spy plane. Um, so you see how uh, how he says uh, protect. Uh, it doesn't say it now. Uh, but sometimes you get an objective to say, hey, uh, you know, destroy the spy plane at uh, G6 or whatever. That could be the AWACS. That would actually be a great implementation of that. Uh, we could have an AWACS that actually talks to us. Hey, you know, uh, 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 Talon Invictus, uh, bogey bearing two nine or zero. 430 or uh, Talon, um, you know, uh, Bo uh, you have a uh, bandit, uh, uh, 330 for 15 or something like that, you know, or a call or, or merge callouts like, oh, Talon, uh, bandit merge, meaning that you just basically cross paths with an enemy, stuff like that. I think that would be awesome if they implemented that. Let's check our six. Seven minutes of fuel. We have to be careful. If we get into a dogfight, we might not make it back to base.
Let's report our location. I spotted something north of me. Two things north of me. Yep, potential hostile there. Pinging, 10 o'clock. Ten o'clock again. It seems stationary. Friendly just got shot down by the uh, MLA. Ten o'clock again. I think that's a stationary transmitter. Guide on me. Guide on me. Yeah, it's gotta be a uh, an air radar. Or oh, I'm sorry, uh, a ground radar. Five minutes feel. Alright, we're gonna head back to base. I don't wanna have that accident happen again. Seven, that's our seven, that that's that's not good. And our five that's the one or five is probably a ground uh, ground radar, but the one or seven. Oh. Oh, 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 we're being followed. I don't know by what, but we're being followed. No fucker, don't black out right now. If it was friendly, it probably identified us already. And. If he was hostile, he also probably identified us already, and I have no clue where he went. If it was an enemy, then he certainly is behind us already. No, I think we're safe. We need to get back to base. We don't have we don't have fuel for this. bolt out of here burners on let's go supersonic God damn it. Oof. That's never a good thing. See, that's why I'm worried, because you never know. Uh, we got, we got some hot stuff going on here. What is that? Two friendlies. Okay. Probably the base AA or AI. Yeah, yeah that's base AI. I'm just not finding people, and some of the ones I find, they get killed before me because we have so many friendlies. I only have one kill and died once because of fuel starvation and literally just couldn't make it back to base. And on top of that, we're not getting any ob any fun objectives like, oh, hey, uh, destroy this, you know, bombers or anything. We're not getting anything. I'm still going to post the video because, you know, why the hell not? You know, I'm, it's a simulator flight, but, and we got one kill at least, but still... It's definitely not going to be as impressive as our 10 kill games or 40 kill games that we've had in the past. Alright, let's turn off our radar so that we don't... Uh, 
cook the ground crew, even though that's not implemented. I like to think that it is. Also, again, I've said it in the past, I actually am not sure if the MiG-23 uh, automatically turns the radar off once you put weight on the wheels, because I know that a lot of modern jets do that. I'm not sure if the MiG-23 does that or if, or if the pilot had to turn it off manually. Let's try to halt our speed here by doing this nose kicks. There we go. That's fine. A little bit of a deviation, but no problem. Actually, that's going to be a big ass deviation. I'm sorry, guys. We need to put more pressure on there the enemy. Go. They're winning. We got our shoot out. Let's do something, guys, because we're not we're not doing jack shit for our team or anything. We're gonna carry bombs and uh, two heat seekers, and we're going to go in and um, bomb some bases, do some work. Otherwise, we're useless as all hell, and I hate being useless. Alright, let me leave the plane and quickly uh, equip it with some bombs because I, I'm, you know, I just hate going around not finding anybody because they're getting killed and then just being useless, not helping my team in any way, shape or form. So, 250s, 100, 250s, 160 kilograms, 38 kilograms, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to take this ones. We need to bomb a base or something because we're, we're not doing anything right now. All right, let's make sure that our um, ballistic computer is... Uh, no, not cannon for ground targets. Rockets, ballistic computer, sure we can keep it on. There you go, cannons, ballistic computer. No, I'm looking for my... Oh, Jesus, okay. As you guys can see, um, I haven't actually carried out bombing operations in in simulator battles uh, or in top tier at all here. Uh, my experience on bombing comes with uh, DCS and my 24,000 hours invested into DCS. So bear with me here. I'm not sure how this game has everything programmed. All right, I got the bombs. I want to enable the CCIP or at least CCRP or something. Rockets, ballistic computer. I'm a, I mean, I'm assuming that the rockets, ballistic computer will work. Cannons, ballistic computer, trash. Okay. I mean, we don't really need it. We can just eyeball it. That's just gonna be annoying. Okay, whatever. It is what it is. gonna bomb the base next to Alpha and while we're on our way there we might check it out and see if we can spot any hostiles there if we have an emergency we're gonna have to jettison everything there's gotta be a ballistic computer for oh shit oh shit okay not a ballistic a CCIP mode I'm not sure how to enable it in in this game like I said guys I I don't usually fly uh, this jets in um, in War Thunder if I do that most of the time I just go to DCS so I'm gonna have to see how to do that real quick let's load our air to air for the moment just in case we have to use them. Guide on me.
Alright, let's IFF. Friendly. Oh, Mark 1.22 with bombs on. That's nice. It's kind of hot. Ten o'clock, probably a Gepard or some anti-air. Oh, what's this? We got two beautiful things over here. The one on the right is friendly. I don't know about the one on the left. Ah, friendly too. Okay. Let me let me load my bombs in case I have to drop them in an emergency. But I can do that just in case. Getting locked from everywhere. I'm assuming those are ground raiders pinging us. Uh, again, terrible assumption to make. This is usually the type of assumptions that get you killed. I want to cross this area. I don't even want to cap this point. I just want to get rid of my bombs by dropping them on the base. I don't know if that's going to help anybody, but. I do not want to climb up. I'm slow, heavy. We got somebody over there. That's definitely going to be a hostile in my opinion. Roll back the video if you didn't see it. I can't see him anymore. We're going to relieve some engine power here I'm not feeling safe whatsoever I should have gone the other way and I don't want to go below the sound barrier right now because it's gonna put the big ass vapor cloud again and it's just gonna make me visible all right there we go now we can Jesus. We're almost there. It's gonna be right after this valley. Look at that. One spawn on back ramp, right next to Alpha. And we're all the way here now. Isn't life wonderful? The enemy is winning. We must counter attack. Big middle finger if you ask me. I have no idea what this base is. No clue whatsoever. I think it's 
This is... Who, who puts a base here? This is like... I mean, I guess it works. It's like the, the most remote location you can possibly... What? I already flew over and I'm about to get clapped by anti-air. Oh, I see. Okay. That was pretty hard to see, actually. Not bad. That's the base I want to be in. <laughs> All right, we got to be careful on our deployment here because those are anti-airs and they're not looking too happy. And we have a big mountain on the way. So do we drop both at a time or? Oh, how did I miss? Okay. Okay, no, I didn't miss. Okay. Right, well, that's our 30 minutes for this video. When I dropped my bombs, my jet continued to drift downward. So I almost hit that mountainside. I would have been able to do it more efficiently if I had CCRP or CCIP, but I guess no. CCIP stands for Constantly Computed Impact Point, CCRP stands for Constantly Computed Release Point. CCRP is used when you're flying uh, level, you know, you can be flying at 30,000 feet, you designate a CCRP point, and um, you know, you don't have to, you don't have to pitch your nose down or anything, you can just the computer you just press and hold the, the pickle button and the computer will release the the bombs when it determines that you're at the exact point of release for the bombs to to actually make contact ccrp is pretty darn cool but it would be a pretty difficult thing to assign in war thunder without being able to have a lightning pod or or a coordinate system that you can input um i guess you could do it by the way that the the f-14 does it where you put the crosshairs on a particular point on the ground you designate you fly away and then you you can actually like toss them um, pretty cool procedure uh, War Thunder could implement something like that uh, to add a little bit of uh, dynamic to the game uh, at this battle rating and um, CCIP is just you know target of opportunity basically you just uh, you see something you position yourself in an advantageous place um, it, realistically, oh, we have a plane in front of us. Uh, realistically, that would essentially mean that you would be um, flying 10,000 feet up in the air and then diving down from 10,000 feet or more and dropping bombs from like 8,000 feet. That's the most optimal um, distance to avoid getting hit by guns that have radar. Alright, we have an A-10 there, I believe. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's a hostile, but we're going to get pretty close to investigate. Our sensor should pick him up. There he is. We have to be very careful now with the anti-airs because we do have some hot anti-airs here. I'm going to burn because, uh, yeah. Just because. Let's go ahead and probe him one more time. Um... Okay, let's, let's stop probing. Okay. Pretty sure that was an anti-air. Pretty sure that's an anti-air. Yeah, pretty sure that's an anti-air. Alright. He could be going to his base, so I gotta be careful here. Yeah, yep, he's an anti-air. You see those bullets coming in. <laughs> Alright, so I see one of their bases. He might be going back to land. Eight minutes of fuel. We're gonna continue burning up 0.12, or I'm sorry, 1.22. Let's give him a quick ping over here, just to verify. Yep, he's a hostile. We have to get pretty close for this missile to hit. Let's go ahead and narrow down the search. Okay, I lost visual in these clouds. I'm assuming he's still flying straight. Uh, this is risky. Okay, we gotta slow down. Nah, alright, we're gonna leave him. His base is gonna start popping us. Could have been a nice kill though.
might get lucky and find somebody on the way back home after I land that's gonna be the end of this video uh, pretty empty video not a lot happened uh, I'm so very sorry for you guys I just we just couldn't find people you know it's not that we couldn't kill them it's just we, we couldn't find them so you know if you can't find we're getting something from five o'clock that might be a base or it might be an f4 oh shit Uh, I, I, I honestly, I don't know what it is. We have to be careful. Let's report our location. way over there. Okay. People just keep getting kills and I have no idea where people are right now. There's no communication. It's frustrating me a little bit. Took a long ass flight found no one I certainly hope you guys uh, enjoyed watching me patrol the skies and <laughs> and um, doing something. Um, you know, it's a flight to flight. If this was real life, you know, uh, I guess you would see something similar. You know, maybe 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 the pilot wouldn't get into a confrontation, or maybe he's just patrolling. And I guess you can take this video as one of those. Even though they definitely don't talk as much as I do. <laughs> Uh, we don't have enough fuel, but you know what? This is the end of the video, so I'm gonna check this out real quick. That looks A10-ish. That definitely looks A10-ish. Yep, it's an A10. Oh, we did something, guys! <laughs> Alright. Let me shut the hell up before I get killed. What are the chances? Wow. Right next to home. Why would he... Why would he do that? I mean, maybe he's trying to kill the Sams. With his, uh... Mavericks. Very well could. Oh, team kill. That's unfortunate. Gears down, flaps down. Next time I will definitely have a configuration um, for, well, I have to test it first. 
So maybe not next time, but I, I definitely want to set up. Um, all right, we gotta we gotta add power here. There we go. We um, I want to set up manual wing sweep control. Shoot is open. Forgot to turn the radar off. Alright guys, that's going to be the end of this video. This ran a little longer than I expected. Um, I'm going to end it here. And I really hope you guys have a good time. Uh, thank you all for watching so much uh, of my videos. And I will catch you guys in the, in the next one. God bless all of you. And have a great time.